Now to coverage from Trumbull County. That's where a sheriff's deputy lost control of his cruiser and crashed into the backyard of a local home. Turns out a local judge lives there. Today he told First News reporter Nadine Grimley about what he heard and saw. You can see the tracks almost back to the, the corner of Gates where he went off the road. Central District Court Judge Thomas Campbell had quite the scene in his backyard early Sunday morning when a sheriff's deputy apparently lost control of his cruiser, stopping within centimeters of Campbell's house. I didn't actually even hear the accident. I was woken by an officer at my front door assuring me it didn't appear that he'd hit my house. Now, if you take a look behind me, you can see the deputy plowed right through that row of trees over there before coming to a stop right next to the back stoop. He had to go right through that first, uh, up this hill, through another small stone uh, surround through my wife's flower garden here. The deputy told Cortland police he was going about 45 miles per hour on State Route 5, heading to help the Ohio State Highway Patrol when he lost traction. Responding officers say the road was a sheet of ice and extremely slippery. The front end of the cruiser was heavily damaged in the crash. I was concerned about the officer, apparently was injured. I've come to understand since not seriously. The deputy was taken to Trumbull Memorial Hospital where he was treated and released. He is expected to be okay, but it's unknown when he'll return to work. In Cortland, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.